the 17 year old me going, yeah, let's tour. And then you're sitting here in Switzerland. You're like, well, that's fucking ticked off the list. That's for sure. <laughs> We live like out of home for X amount of months of the year while we're touring. So you got to learn how to deal with, you know, six or seven other people. Then like, you can't just be in the middle of a city and go, oh, I miss my mom or something. Or, or like, I want to go home. Like you grow up, you mature. Like I think it's, I think it's hard when you first come back home from a tour because you kind of just like, just assimilate back into normal life. It's, it sounds easy, but it's actually quite different because the schedules are just so bizarre and, and ever changing on tour. And then you just go home to like, oh, I can just sit here and eat my breakfast. I don't have to think about anything for like 20 minutes. Yeah, and going to bed at 4 a.m. When you're, when you're at home is like, you go to bed at 4 a.m. It's like, I'm just in the routine. Equinox tour at home with um, our friends in Inhart Swake, which kicks off like two days after we land, after this tour, after this run. Uh, and then we got some stuff that we probably can't talk about because it's secret shit. And, but we're always writing and we're putting out new music soon and yeah. Stuff that we can't talk about is, is actually like just having a break. Yeah, we're gonna have a little break, but it, I'll be writing the whole time. I'll, I'll, I'll be playing so not, a lot of The Division. He'll be playing PlayStation. I'll try and squeeze some PlayStation in there too, if I can, maybe. if I can afford it. Maybe, maybe go, for a, go for a walk. I might do a couple of push-ups to keep, keep that upper body stable. I don't think that I do, but when people mock me, I don't know if they're mocking me in a nice way or a bad way, it's irrelevant. When they imitate me, they do this like, like, like when I, I'm playing, I play guitar, I play guitar like this. I'll like <laughs> pull up a string like that, which looks really lame like that. It might even look really lame normally. I, I, don't, I don't know, but that would be something maybe that I could say is a signature move because they, they they associate it with me. How about um, you? Probably just the the headbang, the windmills. Oh, the windmills. He's been I, a wind, he's with been a windmill for a long you time. Know, like, it was me and Nick, so gotta get it around, shake it around. That's probably the signature. You can't say it's his signature because people have been windmilling for years. You know, just like people, probably heaps of people have been doing things with their arms. Yes, but I'm identified by the window. Yeah, it's just like I'm identified by the arms. I've been enjoying the more abrupt, like, oh cool, the answering it out. I'm just gonna pull it out, make more noise, throw the cable and walk off. We, we probably should have, a, we probably should know, like, what we're gonna do at the end of the set, but I know that I will like maybe ring out one night and one night I'll just like, I'll just stop. Whereas Josh, he'll be like leaving his guitar just, feeding back for ages and ages. I'm already like packing my stuff down and it's still ringing and he's like shaking people's hands. So I don't know if we actually have a thing. We just do whatever we want, I guess. I guess my, when are we feeling, I'm like, okay, cool, 15 minute changeover. This shit oh, has yeah. to get off. Yeah, if we're gonna be <laughs> quick, know, we'll, we'll get off quick and just end it. Thanks. But yeah, oh, it depends on the show as well. I guess if it's a really like, sometimes the crowd's more into it. If it's a really pumping show, like you want to go like, you know, like thanks to oh, the you crowd. Go, go you know, down, like thank you, him. Yeah, thank and him then for if sometimes dealing with all the beatings. Yeah, sometimes if it's a quiet up. night, you're like, right, <laughs> I'm not sure if you guys really liked us tonight, but <laughs> we're just gonna pull our stuff off the stage. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna leave. We're gonna See leave. you next time. Yeah, so it's not your fault. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> but we have to leave. <laughs> Play one more. No, we have to leave. <laughs> I 
hopefully we can keep going in, in the same direction, which is, you know, going upwards. So hopefully. Guess, fingers crossed. But I guess I, one of the goals like back, back in the day was like, I want to tour. You know, like I want to be able to do this and not have to do anything else. So and that was like the, the 17 year old me going, yeah, let's tour. And then you're sitting here in Switzerland. You're like, well, that's fucking ticked off the list. That's for sure. <laughs> I said a Swiss hot chocolate. It was great. Couldn't do that anywhere else. True.